Hey Capricorn, so as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be the hidden truth message for our Capricorns for the month of April 2022. So Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, or North Node, it really doesn't matter, love. If you in any way at all identify as a Capricorn, then this reading is for you, okay? Capricorn, let's go ahead, get into this reading, see what it is the Spirit has to say to you all. What is going on? What is going down? What are these messages? The Seven of Cups, okay? Followed by the Chariot. The Queen of Swords. The King of Wands. The Three of Cups. Capricorn, somebody is trying to play you for a fool here, okay? Whoever this fire sign is, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius person, this person is trying to leave you in a state of confusion or uncertainty, okay? They're preventing you from moving forward, moving ahead with your life. I feel like this person and you, maybe you had some sort of romantic situation or involvement going on, but you're being guided to embody the Queen of Swords energy here, okay? So you're being embodied to keep it moving, focus on your future, not look at them, not worry about them. Them, not any distractions because this person is showing up with the seven of cups energy complete distraction here okay whoever this fire sign is i feel like some of you may be blinded by the way that this person looks okay um if you were wondering like why is our relationship just at a standstill why is it not moving forward why are we not going to the next level with the chariot here it's because they're involved with you and someone else or there's a possibility here that this person only sees you as a friend however i feel like they're taking advantage of the fact that they know you have feelings for them okay the underlying energy here currently is the hermit so i feel like you guys are being guided to go ghost on this person or to give them a taste of their own medicine yeah we have the six of cups here okay so i feel like this person is very immature at times okay despite how old they are and we have the knight of swords like i said i feel like um you guys are going to be having a conversation with this person in the near future where you're letting them know like hey this is how you're making me feel i don't like it and if things don't change this is what i'm gonna do okay because the queen of swords doesn't take any bs she does not tolerate any nonsense so i feel like the reason spirit is guiding you to um embody that energy is because this person is playing with you okay it's like like i said they know you have these feelings for them so they're like oh well this is how capricorn feels for me i'm going to take advantage of that you know even if the feelings are not mutual okay so let us see what's going on here with this seven of cups energy for our capricorns but they are certainly trying it, okay? They're trying it, they're trying you, they trying it, okay? Let us see what's going on with the Seven of Cups for our Capricorns, okay? Yeah, we have the Four of Pentacles. They're trying to hold on to you, okay, here with the Four of Pentacles. Um, I feel like there is some sexual attraction or sexual chemistry between you and this person, but they're making it seem like that's as far as it goes, okay? The Chariot energy here for our Capricorns. Why is this here in the Challenge Position, Spirit, please? show us okay we have the ten of pentacles yeah so it's like you guys want to build a life with someone you want to um have a great foundation as far as a friendship goes and then build trust and all of the necessary ingredients you feel goes into a stable relationship a healthy relationship but this person is playing with you okay um this is really crazy it's like I feel like some of you are aware of this though, okay, which is why you're putting yourself in this Queen of Swords energy. You're like, listen, no, I know what I want. You can't give it to me, then see you later, okay? Nice knowing you. And yeah, I feel like that's the right move, Capricorn, okay? Queen of Swords for our Capricorns here. Queen of Swords. Yeah, we got the Ten of Cups, like I said, because you want harmony. You know what you want with the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. You want to build a life with someone. Follow your intuition with the high priestess. Trust that, you know, this person is not telling you everything. I feel like you guys are intuitively aware of that, okay? You're able to uh, get a glimpse into the unknown or the unseen here with this high priestess energy, okay? Let us see. King of Wands for our Capricorns, please, okay? We have the Ten of Wands. Yeah, this person is a burden. I feel like they're holding you back. They're keeping you back, okay? Um, they're still trying to find their footing in life is what it feels like. Like, they have a lot going on that they have to deal with, a lot of baggage, okay, that's preventing them from moving forward. But once again, they're not communicating that with you. I feel like this is something you intuitively know or you intuitively feel, okay? Let us see the three of cups for our capricorns please spirit this three of cups energy what is this okay we have the three of wands 
yeah so i feel like in the near future you're going to tell that person like look let's just be friends it is what it is okay um i also feel like you guys are going to get your confidence back here with this queen of wands energy okay you're going to feel extremely confident because now you're no longer trying to make an offer to someone who clearly is refusing your offer or doesn't want it um i see the ten of swords energy here as well so i feel like you guys are going to be just abruptly walking away abruptly ending the situation like listen thanks but no thanks okay i feel like at this point you realize you've wasted a lot of time and you're tired of wasting your time okay six of cups and the knight of swords energy here for our capricorns yep the empress okay some of you have children that you're focused on it's like i'd rather focus on my children on my household or more important things than just standing around and waiting on somebody with the seven of pentacles to realize what i am or what i offer okay and i feel like from you doing this this is going to put you in a whole new light with that person but at by that um, excuse me by that point you're not even going to be interested anymore okay it's like at that 